Hey guys. So when we have been out and about on our overlanding adventures, um, last couple of episodes we have talked about um, two pieces of gear that we have truly loved and so I wanted to take a moment to show you how to actually install them. The next thing that we have that has replaced our basically our clothing bag is we call them saddle bags. Um, online they're called roll bar bags but these attach to the um, roll bars and we have two of these. Um, his and hers and they, they fit. We have those attached to the roll bars on our own side of the bed um, for us to pack our clothes and um, well just all our overnight stuff. Just it holds anything. everything. It's a catch-all. So we're going to show you how to install this and also how much room there actually is in these bags. As you can see they're pretty big bags and so they carry um, they hold a lot of stuff so we're going to show you how to do that. All right let's do it. install the saddle bags and the great thing about these saddle bags if you'll take a look there are several pouches here that you can just slide things into um, those are great little pouches for when we're sleeping that we can put our cell phones um, a drink and that sort of thing we have a hideaway pouch here that goes fairly deep I would say about six inches um, down through there you also have another zip pocket here on the front that again goes another six to eight inches so it opens up there the um, these little molly straps and you get quite a selection of the um, straps to use to, to tie stuff onto these things um, and then you have these little pouches we got little pouches here and here again good for diet coke fits down in there um, pens flashlights we have a, a, a little Larry. Larry that we use that will sit up right in there so that way we can turn it on while we're in the in the Jeep um, so yeah, it's got a lot of pouches. Again, another pouch here, other little places to strap Molly strap. And then the actual opening, it will flap down. And, and look at that, it's like Tons of space. Real. And we're gonna pack it for you guys to show you how much you can actually get into this bag. So whether you're using it for clothes, um, you know, for overlanding like we do, or you can use it for tools. I mean, you can fit a ton of tools and supplies in there, your, your toe straps, um, things of that nature can go in there. Um, like I said, plenty of places for tools down in here. So um, it's the possibilities are endless. So you have these rings and the straps go through them and then these will hook to the roll bar. So um, we are actually putting this, one thing I want to note is that, um, as we said, we've already used these bags. So we're t we've taken them down because I realized when I put them up the first time, I put them around the seatbelt, which is not a problem if you don't have passengers. Um, but you know, in case anybody does want to get in the back and use the seatbelt, you don't want to strap the seatbelt to the roll bar. And the cool thing with these various straps that you have, um, the option is just to strap it wherever. So on this side, for instance, we have our first aid kit as well as our um, our bar tack um, fire, fire extinguisher uh, holder and fire extinguisher. So these straps, since I have multiple places to put them, I can work around that particular item so that's what we're going to do now so once she gets this thing up I'll, I'll show you guys why i love it and i didn't think that i would again just like the attic i thought uh, these are just gimmicky items and i don't know if it's really going to be that useful but what makes what we do a little differently than a lot of the overlanders that you see is we're not using a rooftop tent we're not using a ground tent we're not using a trailer we actually sleep right here in the jeep and so um, this was a neat way to store things right beside where we sleep. So at night you can throw your phone in one of those little pockets. You've got your flashlight right there for when you have to get up in the middle of the night to go pee. Um, everything is right there within reach to where you're laying. So, you know, if you are carrying a pistol or something like that, it's right there beside you, easy to get to. 
So this thing definitely just makes, especially if you're sleeping in your Jeep, um, it's so useful. And what else could they use it for? Tools? Um, all their recovery kids. gear. You got kids, they can store all their stuff in it while you guys are riding. Um, we always forget about that because we don't have children, but that would be a great catch-all for your kids. So it just senses up, cinches up nice and tight. And so what she's doing is just kind of picking and choosing which loop that she wants to go around so that it fits around the other stuff that's mounted on that roll bar. The only downside that, that we've seen with this roll bar mount is because in the summer she's going to be mounting some uh, some pod speakers up there. So we'll have to kind of see what fits and what doesn't. How many straps are actually holding it up right now? Right now I have three. I did have four and I'm still trying to get in that seat belt. There we go. That'll work. I don't think I need to even put one down here at the bottom. I think I need one more up top though. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get that around there though actually. Well, maybe not then. Cause I mean, three is holding it just fine. Um, and then that way the seat belt can still move around it. Yep. But you see what I'm saying? It, it just, it's so, it's so up and out of the way, and you can see where she's sitting. That would be where I would be sleeping. And wait until you see what what all you can pile in these things. We'll go ahead and start um, loading it up in our handy controls. All right, guys. So since that's my side, we thought we would show you what all this thing can hold. And we're not even gonna try to max it out. We're just gonna say we're doing a, I don't know, we think a four day trip. So we got five shirts, three pairs of pants. Now the key, if any of you guys don't know about packing, um, the best way to pack as much stuff as possible and to avoid wrinkles is to roll your clothes. So you just start rolling them, rolling the wrinkles out just like you would a, a um, sleeping bag. And that's gonna help you avoid wrinkles as well. So what was that? Four shirts, three pairs of pants. And guys, my shirts five aren't shirts. five shirts. My shirts aren't small. I'm like uh, six one, almost 300 pounds. And my pants are definitely not small. So, uh, and she's still got room to go. Well, and the, you know, this is just the shirts and the pants. So remember you have the zip pouches here that you can stick underwear and socks in um, yep. and the pouch here that goes all the way back. And normally we stick the, um, sometimes we'll stick the bathroom bag in there if we have room for it. But the cool thing is that now this saddle bag has formed a little cubby right here um, in between the window and the bag. So that's where we'll stick like towels or our bathroom bag if we don't have room in there. But again, it's just another catch-all for you to make some, um, some storage. So now you guys will see. Um, so even with all of that, we still have plenty of space to fill up. I mean, we could easily get another pair of pants, probably two or three more shirts. Um, and that's, I mean, we could probably even get more than that in there. So, so yeah, um, like I said, plenty of space for underwear and socks here, more space here for um, storing. Um, so yeah, so it, it's, I mean, guys, it just fits so much. Um, 
And I'll be honest, the, the brand, you don't remember the brand name of these, but we do have the link on Amazon, and I do know that they were very, very affordable. Mm -hmm. um, what was the price for the pair? I think pair? it's sixty three ninety nine for the pair. And uh, they've been phenomenal. Yeah. So uh, we'll put the link in the description there. And uh, again, fits up beautifully. These items: the Jeep Attic by Blue Ridge Overland Gear, and the roll bar bags or saddle bags, as we call them, were just fantastic. Anything else to add? No, I think that's it. All right. Don't forget your beer. Thanks for joining us. Be All sure right. to subscribe, like, share, hit click the, the little bell yeah. so hit, that you'll get, get notifications when we post new videos. And um, until next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>